Sharman Kohli, who was arrested in a drug case last week, was to stay in the custody of the Narcotics Control Bureau only till September 1st. However, his custody has now been extended. A Mumbai court on Wednesday remanded the actor to 14-day judicial custody. He was arrested from his Mumbai home by the NCB following the seizure of 25 grams of MD drugs from his house. Kohli has been booked under sections 21A, 27A, 28A, 29, 30 and 35 of the NDPS Act. As per a report, the actor came under the scanner on the basis of certain disclosures made by one Ajay Raju Singh, the main drug peddler who has been detained for interrogation. Arman was arrested a day after TV actor Gaurav Dixit was taken into custody after the investigative agency recovered MD and Charas from his residence. The agency had conducted raids at five places in Mumbai and Nala Sopara based on the lead they got following Kohli's arrest. Talking about his arrest, NCB Zonal Director Samir Wankhede had earlier said, After the raid, actor Arman Kohli gave ambiguous answers to questions put up by NCB. He was then taken into custody for questioning at the NCB office. He also revealed that apart from consumption, there are several other charges levelled against him. In addition to Wang Kedi's statement, an NCB official has also shared an I quote, After interrogating Singh, we launched a follow-up operation on Saturday afternoon. Subsequently, a team of NCB officials raided Arman Kohli's houses and recovered a small quantity of cocaine from him. Later, a case was registered against him and he was shown arrested. The NCB is probing the route and links through which the seized cocaine found its way to Mumbai. We are also checking the involvement of other traffickers. The official also claimed that at the time of his arrest, Arman was found in an inebriated condition. This is not Arman's first brush with the law. He was arrested some years back after his stint at the Big Boss 7 house for allegedly assaulting co-contestant Sofia Hayat. He was later released on bail.